Well, from an inspection report from the State Department of Health, one of the many deficiencies was that the mattresses were damaged and not clean. The jail says this is a way to address that issue. Just luxury compared to the old mattresses. Out with the old, in with the new. We've replaced them with a thicker mattress. It's got a built-in pillow. They have, uh, they're sealed up so they can, um, to prevent contaminants and bed bugs from infesting them. The Oklahoma County Jail taking steps to create a more livable space by adding new mattresses inside the facility for detainees. Spending over $160,000 of leftover money from last year's budget. Everybody loves them. They're, they, they're wondering why this hadn't happened sooner. <laughs> But it's also a question Mark Falk, a community activist, has been asking for years. My first reaction, honestly, was too little too late. Um, I think it's a great idea. Let me preface with that. I believe it's a great idea, but we've had bed bugs in there for years. He says while it's a step in the right direction, it should have happened yeah. sooner. If you stop and think about it, if you had bed bugs in your house, would you wait? three to five years to take measures to get rid of them or in your business, absolutely not. It's easy to go around and say those things, but this is evidence that we are making an effort to make things better for them here. And they get a shipment of mattresses every few weeks. They say by the end of September, everyone should have one.